You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have uh, everybody's favorite, Fred Fontaine. Fred, hey, welcome. Thank you, Mark. Thank you very much for Fred, having I, me. I met you a long time ago, and uh, it was the first Haitian Flag Day. Long, long time Quite ago. Some you time were ago. you were president of Shoop. That's right. One of the funders to also you know. South Shore Haitians United for Progress. Yes. And now you're in the mayor's office, but you're still involved with Shoop. You're a proud, proud member of the Haitian community. What's happening? We got our, our favorite event of the year. Well, first of all, let me thank you, uh, Mark, for having me. And um, also, uh, I want to say hi to everybody listening today um, and to watching today. Um, today, you know, as you know, um, we've been uh, friends for a long time, and you've been very helpful to the Haitian community, you know, especially Shoop. Mm -hmm. um, we did quite a few things years ago together and helping the Haitian community. At that time, you know, Brockton was really vibrant too, mm -hmm. you know, uh, under Jack units and all. And this is when we've been founded and we've been very blessed at that time to have a lot of help from Mayor Unit at that time too. And um, the Haitian community, as a matter of fact, was a little bit, you know, timid, I could say in French. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I did have some great help from different uh, folks. You know, I could name. I don't want to name anybody because they know themselves. Sure. Uh, basically, we are here today because we want to talk about uh, Flag Day, Haitian Flag Day. We celebrate every year. Um, as uh, now, uh, I am the vice president of Shoop. Mm -hmm. um, we do have Pastor Lord, or she is the president, and we have Tony. She is a marketing director. We have Mervlin, she's the secretary right now. But we are struggling, you know, I got to tell you, you know, Shoop is struggling because we are looking for space. We are looking for uh, board members, and, uh, but we're still, we're still working. We remember the last year we had a nice, uh, you know, we, not, we had a night function now. Yeah. And, you know, and, and it was beautiful. Uh, Flag Day is one of the best, uh, you, I know you love it. <laughs> And, uh, I've only missed one, just <laughs> I know, one. I, I was away at a conference year. and I was very upset. Yeah, but I know, that was beautiful. It's, you know what's nice about the Flag Day? Mm -hmm. The children. Ah, oh, this is exactly. Okay, it, because you, there were lots of flag raisings at City Hall and they were all good. It's nice to no, see the flag the raise. That's one is no, the best. No, the reason it's the best is the children from all over the school system. They come, they, they come from the academy over yes. on uh, Court Street, Court Street as no, well. Exactly. And, 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 uh, it, it has a different spirit. It has a real vibe to it, and everybody's friendly. Yes. We, we usually get good weather, so we're Always we're looking at Friday the twentieth of May. Exactly, exactly. Okay. Uh, it's going to be at behind City Hall. Last year we did it um, at Walkie Marciano uh, because you know, fix, you know they were fixing City Hall. So this year we're going to have it uh, at City Hall, like the usual place that we do, and um, we're going to have. Uh, guest speakers, the mayor's gonna be there, you know, city councilors, you know, superintendent gonna be there. It's gonna be like Haitian consul gonna be there. All the children that you guys love are gonna be there. And um, we're gonna have some fun. And uh, the event gonna start, um, again, let me repeat the date. It's Friday, May 20, uh, 10 a.m. sharp. Mm -hmm. uh, not Haitian time. Okay, I, was, I was gonna <laughs> check on that, Fred, because sometimes, it, sometimes it's a little that's gonna be, delayed. That's, no, it's gonna be in at 10. We're gonna start at 10 exactly, because we want everybody to be there by nine, and we start at 10 exactly, you know. Um, the weather gonna be beautiful, I promise you, like usual. Uh, we're gonna have um, those children singing, we're gonna have you know, some show, and at the end, by 12, we'll be ended by, uh, by 12, like uh, usual, because the boss have to take those kids back to school, right? Um, because they have they have quite some time enjoying the day. And um, any question people need, they could call me directly, you know, at 774-259-0000. Uh, if they want to participate, call me. And if they want to donate also, because we're looking for donation, water. Uh, we are giving soda. You know, if somebody wants to donate something, please feel free to call me and let me know. And uh, we will be very glad to have those for those kids, you know. Now, I know you have a guest speaker. You have uh, Willie Wilson, who yes. is from, formerly from Brocken High. Yes. He's retired, but I understand I th he's, t he's still teaching. Oh, I yeah, he's still teaching he's at, at, um, Spelman. at the Spelman. At the Spelman. Spelman. Yeah, he's at Carlton. So I, I never had the privilege of having him as my oh, teacher. I had great history teachers, and I always knew him and was involved with him at the Historical Society. Yeah. But Willie's a treat, and Willie ties in all the cultures together. Oh. The, the, the nice thing, Fred, about 
the Haitian celebrations is you tie everyone in. You always say it's not about just Haitian people. You That's want true. people to know your culture. That's correct. And uh, you got me a long time ago because you got me with the food. Ah, you like that, huh? Right, okay. It's not New Year, so we can't yeah. do the squash soup in oh, May. We can still do it any okay. time, you know. But uh, we'll, we'll, at some point, we'll have some other news and some uh, adventure that you're doing. Up, yes. But um, so we have Willie speaking. We have um, the kids singing. I yep. know usually they do poetry yep. You're gonna have and, poetry and from spoken Bob word. Yep. And it's in, it's in, it's in, it's gonna it's be in Haitian Creole and in English. That's correct, yeah. It's going to be in Haitian and, um, and Creole and English, you know. Basically, you guys have to come and enjoy the day because a um, long time ago we used to have it for the adults and the adults never showed up. So it used to be city hall coming down and then I see all those white guys. Well, I see, where's my Haitian fellows? So we end up with the, the help of mayor unit and uh, at that time also the superintendent at that time that was, uh, uh, what's which, his name? Which one? The uh, first. Uh, I'm trying to think what, uh, uh, Nem Nemrakow? No, or, no, before him. Before him. Oh, before him. You're testing my knowledge. That's okay. okay. That's okay. Well, we'll, we'll, he, we'll helped, he, he helped us out on getting those kids. You know, that's the only place I could believe in the United States you have to let your children come out to celebrate their, their flag. And, and you know what? It's not just the flag. It's the... They let them out. They wear... Yes. The red, white, and blue. Yes. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of similarities with the Haitian culture mm -hmm. and... United States, okay, Independence Day, certain yes. days of the year. So you're going to hear all about it, and you're going to experience. They provide the bosses, song. and yeah. they help out. They call, you know, all of all of those folks coming over and speak on, on the Haitian flag, and Haitian flag day for for the Haitian, you know, like the mayor, you know, the city councilors, you know, I mean, you, you know, the superintendent, you name it, and everybody wants to speak, to say a few words to those kids because they are the future of Brockton, not only of Brockton, but of America because now you know they're going to be involved more and we need some good kids to stay involved and help the city which is Brockton need help well we know that we know with you still behind the helm you know there's this new leadership pastor Lodz is very, very capable yes. Yes. but it's good always to see people stay with something they really love yes. which you you were the found one of the founders yes I am one day. of those founders, and you know. everybody everybody works together so I see you got a couple of other brochures too I got one more just, brochure just, to pass over because this is also a part of shoop we're going to have that um, at uh, Walking Marciano this is going to be started in July uh, which is a uh, United Soccer Fest okay and uh, we're going to have soccer and also uh, like kind of music and have those kids to get involved instead of going on the street playing. Oh. We have them uh, uh, every Saturday, starting from July to August, one mm -hmm. month. And it was very nice of, um, of Mike uh, from the superintendent school, you know, help us out uh, oh, on uh, getting that stadium to help. Because we're we're going to bring you back for this one. Yeah, we'll, we'll promote it. Back, we'll yeah. do a little promotion of it ahead mm -hmm. of time. You could okay. keep that in case you need that. And, okay. Uh, we really appreciate your help, my friend. And uh, we'll be there. It's always a pleasure. Couple of cameras and and, and us. All right. So let me just recap real quick. Friday, May twentieth, ten a.m. City Hall Plaza, a Haitian Flag Day celebration. Guest speaker Willie Wilson. Few words by Mayor Carpenter. But the best part of all are the kids. So be there. Um, and there were a lot of nice sponsors that supported it. If you need more information, Fred's number. He gave you a cell phone number: seven seven four two five nine. 0096 and uh, you're watching Greater Brockton. Stay tuned for more events, places, people and faces right here in the City of Champions.